kids you technical i'm back again with another video today as you can see i have a product from white stone dome and i want to say thank you white stone dome for sending me out some of your products so i currently have the dome premium film and i have the the dome contrast case and the dome glass ease for your vfo3 camera they also sent me out the uh, dome glass for the front display of your Z Fold 3. And I was trying to prepare that video for you, for YouTube, for uh, YouTube, but I did not, it didn't go as planned and as well. So I will not be uploading that video, but I did want to let you know that they did send me the uh, screen protector for the outer, dis the dome glass or the outer display, but I tried it twice and it did it, it I, I messed up just know that I messed up and now we're gonna move on to the inner display this this is for the inner display this is a film and it also comes with film for the outer display and we're gonna install these and move them uh inner display screen protector so just gonna rip it open like so And this is what you get. You get the inner display and you get the, okay, well, that's nice. So you get the inner display and you also get one for the outer display. So, hey, look, I have something for the outer display, but it's not glass, but I'm still use it. And you also get one for the back display. I don't know if I'm gonna use the back display, but we're gonna try to, we're gonna attempt to install these two. You also get the Ouija and you get your microfiber cleaning cloth, your wet wipe and your dust removable stickers. And that is all you currently get in that box. So now we are going to do this the right, the way it should be done. So first we're going to try, we're going to, uh, put on the outer display screen protector for the Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 3. So here's my Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 3 and its beautifulness. So you just wanna, you wanna use your wet wipe, but I'm not gonna use that cause I've already had to clean this up. So I'm just gonna wipe it down, wipe it down, wipe, wipe. Wipe now. Let me wipe it down. I'm just gonna wipe it down. And then you want to follow the instructions. These ones are a lot easier for me. A little bit. Place it on like so. Line up everything. Then. It gives you a guide. I don't know how well you can see that, but it gives you a guide. And then what you would wanna do is just get out the bubbles first. And then you will lift this up here, slide it out like that. Peel this off like that. To me, the films are much easier than uh, white stones uh, tempered glass. Just That's just me though, so. Pretty much now, my the front of my Z Fold 3 is protected, but this is the film screen protector, which is okay for me. I don't mind a film screen protector. Uh, I have a little bubbles, but by the day and by the night and the week, those will eventually go away. But if you're just a bubble freak and you don't want them there, you can keep working them out. Like so, I'm not too worried about it because I know over time they will eventually work their way out. So that's what that looks like. So now we're gonna open up the display like so. We're gonna repeat the same steps, but on the 7.6 inch screen display. But for this display, I will use my wet wipe to get it all clean shiny for the video so 
you will just want to clean it like so you know you don't apply too much pressure but just make sure you get all the little kinks and dirt and dust out and grime out and make sure you also have clean fingertips too because those hold dirt moisture and oil you can use your dust removable stickers if you want to so for the heck for the sake of the video just use your dust removable stickers like so so pretty much that's that now currently opening up screen protector Okay, so now, this is what the screen protector looks like. So all you would wanna do, you would have to line this up with your camera, like so. And then you would just peel back on the things that you need to peel back on, on the tab. So this is, I think this is one the back don't do it the way I'm doing it I just do it this way because it's better for me to handle but please be careful when you do this because if you mess it up you just mess it up but you just want to line it up good with the uh, camera cut out about there is good enough for me because this does not go edge to edge then you just want to do that like that and then then okay so now I'm going to lift this back like this and I'm going to just take my guide pull it this way as you can see it is currently coming off just like that and that is on the screen like so so we would need to just repeat the same steps on the other side like i said i may have did mine backwards but that's just the best way i can do it for me you do it how you want to do it but just be careful but as long as it's on there and on there the right way then it should it doesn't matter how you put it on as long as it's on there and on there the right way i am happy and i'm i'm pleased you know so my z fold three i don't get any scuffs nicks scratches because it does have a nasty scuff on the front i don't know where it came from but it's okay because now i have it protected and it's it's visible but it's not fillable so basically this is what the inside of it will look like put it on like so i could have did a little bit better in that corner there but that'll be all right i don't think that's going to lift up so pretty much this is what the premium film looks like on the it on the inside and on the outside like I said, don't worry about your bumps. Don't worry about the bubbles. They will work their way out unless you're just a bubble freak. So just rate, comment, and subscribe to this YouTube tech channel. And I'll catch you in the next video. I'm out.